Hello everyone, my name is Dr. Jacobs. I'm a doctor of physical therapy and I'm an inventor of Aster Specialty. I'm also a cancer survival and I used to suffer from chronic migraines, headache, pain and fatigue before I invented Aster Specialty. All right, Anthony, tell me what's going on with your feet. What happened? Well, I can't describe what happened. I've just changed shoes and, and okay. ever since then my pain has been intolerable. Um, it feels like I have plantar fasciitis. I'm not mm -hmm. a doctor. I don't know, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. but um, it's to the point where I can't. I can barely walk when I get home from work. Um, mm -hmm. Been having my wife kind of massage me to help okay. see if that's a problem mm -hmm. or if that can help out. Um, hasn't really been helping anything. Um, so I found you on YouTube and mm -hmm. I'm hoping this is going to yeah. be the, uh, the end result. Mm -hmm. So how long has been going on? Uh, about a year, year and a half. Year and a half. Okay, so we had a year and a half for bilateral, both plantar fasciitis pain, and uh, during this time, what kind of treatment did you receive? Um, just doing massages, massages. Uh, from like a chiropractor. You know, the chiropractor. Okay. Um, I did a, a what do you call that? Did acupuncture. You acupuncture. acupuncture. Okay. Um, very minimal mm -hmm. relief. Did you have any orthotic injections or anything? Um, I've, I've got orthotics from the um, chiropractor. Mm -hmm. um, didn't work. Um, okay. I've looked as far as going on Amazon to see if there was any kind of support system okay. for that plantar fasciitis, and mm -hmm. I ordered some, and mm -hmm. um, those barely, they're, they're not even doing anything for me. So, okay. so can you tell me what is your, exp uh, your pain right now? For right now, where I'm sitting, I'm at about a five. Five, it's where do you feel it exactly? On my right side the most. It's it's pretty much on the the outside yeah of the, the outside of the foot to going underneath towards the heel. So you have a constant pain five out of ten. Mm -hmm. Okay, when you stand on your feet, how much pain do you feel? It jumps up from from sitting. It's a five. When I stand up, it goes up mm -hmm. into the seven eight range. You okay, know, what so. kind of pain do you experience? It's sharp, dull, aching. How you describe it? It's like an achy, mm -hmm. you know, sharp pain when on I your step, feet. yeah, okay. I, I feel like I'm about 80 years old once I jump so up, like it's, it's, and yeah. stuff like that. So do you feel more pain in the morning um, uh, when you take the first few steps and you feel pain with, uh, like after rest and taking a few steps, is that correct? Is that yeah. increasing your pain level in, in and the then morning, starting? Yeah, in the morning I wake up, I, I step out of bed and it's just snap, crackle, pop, and it's just intense pain like until I get my muscles moving I guess mm -hmm. and then it'll go away where it's mm -hmm. tolerable you know and then yeah. at the end of my work day mm -hmm. or after I've walked so much on them it, mm -hmm. it's like it's uh, I'm, I'm ready to just stay in one spot mm -hmm. yeah so this is classic uh, presentation of plantar fasciitis what's going on with your calf because you start to say you have calf and back issue what's going on the calf it just feels really tight mm -hmm. um, like a burning sensation. Okay, the whole thing or the just whole thing, the whole okay. calf, yeah. And, and that's um, started at the same time, or happened like after? That? It's it's about the same. It, it uh -huh. started it started and it seemed like it went to the feet, mm -hmm. and it could have been both ways. I mean, I I couldn't I possibly could have started in the hip foot and not really felt it much, okay. mm -hmm. you know. But it, I know it's a combined of both mm -hmm. combination of okay. both now. Yeah. Any other symptoms I need to know? No, that's okay, so it's worse than the right, yeah. Yeah. Okay. So I uh, will have you walk, and we'll have you walk in the hallway. Mm -hmm. I want to see how you walk back and forth, and give me your pain level. Okay. okay. All right. So how much pain from zero to ten? It's it's like at a seven. And you you you're just limping because of the pain. I'm just I'm afraid I'm afraid of stepping because it's yeah and it's just discomfort. So that's the way you walk so, now. Yeah, and I'm like, One it's, more time. It's uh, very mm -hmm. discomforting. You see, it's his limping. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I don't know if you can hear it, but it's popping. I hear that the clicking. Yep. I don't know if it's easy to hear in the camera or not, but I hear it. Um, okay, so let's lie on your stomach. So most of your pain is the outside, is that correct? Yeah, the outside and then the Both of them? Yes. In here, what about here or here? That's right at the hill where you touched, you went from the in side. In here? Yeah, right is in that there. painful what I'm doing? Yes. So that's increased your pain? Yeah. So, okay. Make sure what I'm doing is not increasing your pain. Okay. Because you said you have a 5 out of 10 constant pain. We don't want to increase that. Okay. So, if I'm increasing it, 
just let me know and I will take it easy. Otherwise, um, we'll just keep working on it, okay? Alright. So what happened here? It looked like a incision. Yeah, I had a, a, a softball injury. Okay. I, I broke my ankle. Okay. And, uh, so they did a surgery on it and they uh, put a screw holding the tendon onto my ankle and then they, I broke my fibula so they put a plate with six screws holding Man, the fibula. that's through. rough. Yeah. And when did that happen? That was in 2006. 2006, okay. So uh, which uh, foot is worse, left or right? Uh, the right foot, which is over here on the side. And you had it both at the same time, yeah? Yeah. And yeah. at one point it was the left foot that was bad, and mm -hmm. then it switched over to the right foot now. Okay. Make sure next time you bring all your shoes here, okay? Okay. I want to take a look at it to make sure you're wearing the right shoes, your work shoes and everything. I want to make sure it's fitted correctly and it's not a risk factor for plantar fasciitis. You feel this knot here? Yes. This bum? Mm -hmm. They can come here and watch if they want. You feel this bone? Maybe go. Is it too much? No, you're good. Mm -hmm. Is it too much what I'm doing? No, okay. no, you're fine. So, do you feel the calf tightness internally or externally? It, it feels uh, internally. Internally? Yeah. Is it the whole area or just a spot? Um, it's like the inner side, like the inside part mm -hmm. of the calf. Mm -hmm. And it happened at the same time that you had your plantar issue, yeah? Yes. Okay. So it's been tight for a year now? Yeah? Yes. Uh -huh. Okay. So today, I'm going to work only on the, on the proliferation stage now, okay? Okay. Try to clear up everything. So if you feel better after the treatment, that means you're stuck in the proliferation stage. I'm not going to jump to the... Uh, inflammation uh, protocol, okay? okay? So I will wait until to figure out uh, is it pure new proliferation or your body is just going back and forth between proliferation and inflammation stage. Is it too much? No, you're okay. You feel that grinding here? Yeah. Okay, that's a scar tissue. Feel it feels like blood's flowing. Blood's flowing? You know I mean? That's fine. We can drink a little bit more water. You start to feel a little bit warmness and sensation there, feeling. That's a good sign that let's start rushing that area. So we'll have you walk. Yes. Okay. Okay. Can you tell me how's that? All right, so. Mm -hmm. It's still a little bit on the right, but it's. Mm -hmm. It's a lot better. I could feel my feet more. You're not you're not as limping as before. You're mm -hmm. walking a little bit faster. I can feel, feel the it? motion in my legs. So that was like seven when we when you walked before. How much is now? How do you feel? Right now it's it's almost gone. It's up probably about a three or four. You Where? Know I mean? The right side still underneath, like underneath right here. Now it's right here now. That's the right side. Yeah. Okay, what about the left side? Left side, it feels good. So the left side is fine. We're just working on the right side. Mm -hmm. So you probably like stuck in the proliferation on the left side. On the left one? Yes, because you feel no pain. Yeah. Okay. You might have a little bit of inflammation here. Right. So do you have seizures or any no. or pacemaker or anything like that? So I'm going to use a special magnet to decrease the inflammation. So if it's a mild inflammation, it's just going to take a few minutes with the magnet. So we will know how severe your inflammation based on your response to the magnet. So we'll have you lying on your stomach. So we work on the right side now, yeah? Okay. Okay. And you said it's right in here, yeah? Yes. Okay. We'll get you more water. And did you feel anything in the calf or the calf was fine when you walked? No, the calf seemed good. It seemed okay. nice and loose. 
So the calf and the left foot is nice. We just have a little bit of inflammation here. So you walk. Okay. Let's drink some water. Hello. Hi. Hi. How are you? Good. How's that? <laughs> you feel it or it's gone? No, I feel it. I mean, I've, I still got little pops here and there, but it's. What about the pain? The pain is is it's subsided. I mean, it's not there like it was. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I can stand straight right now. Like I feel planted. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? So uh, um, it's totally gone, or you still have a little. It's. Bit? I don't feel the pain there. Yeah. So let's walk a couple of times. And if you don't feel, set up, like let's suck your belly button in, just nice posture. When you walk, you don't have to look down. And tell me how does that feel? Definitely, your gait speed is improved a lot. Like it, it, big time. Yeah, I mean, I, I feel normal. I feel yeah. like I'm back to normal mm -hmm. walking. That's awesome. Any pain or it's gone? No, there's no pain. <laughs> I don't feel awesome. I don't feel any pain in All my right. foot. All right. So you had it for a year, and you had a chiropractor year. massage. So and can you that. can you yeah. tell the difference with the treatment? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes, it's. I'm glad I found, yeah. I found you, man. Awesome. That's awesome. I feel yeah. planted and I feel standing straight now. Straight, I'm like, not yeah, I'm not hurting yeah. and worried That's about beautiful. where I'm stepping. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I feel mm -hmm. like I'm, I'm grounded again. My feet are flat. Mm -hmm. My muscles feel loose. And no pain. No pain. Okay, awesome. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Feel free to subscribe to my channel to get helpful tips on how to relieve pain and watch real treatment videos. There are over 45 studies that support Aster treatment model. If you are a patient and would like to schedule an appointment or treat yourself at home, check the link below. If you are a healthcare provider and would like to receive Aster training and buy Aster instrument, check the link below. See you soon.